M0FXB, welcome to my videos learning how to use the Gianpi 8800 Plus. M0FXB, thought I'd do a power test on this Gianpi. I think they're advertised around 10 watts. So we've got our uh, SWR meter here. You can see the last reading I got was nearly 6 watts. Uh, we've got a dummy load on the end here. It's the SWR33 Plus and it's the Juan Pi 8800 Plus. You get these for about 65 to 80 pound. They're quad band radios. They have GPS and Bluetooth. I'm not sure if we get the GPS now. Let's have a look. Yeah, we do, look. GPS, see, that's not bad, is it? And Bluetooth programming as well. So you can program all the memory channels using an app. Right, so let's just clear this off and do another power test. The fun thing is that you can actually uh, push this button, it makes, it turns around the reading, which is pretty good. So look, nothing on there at the moment. Let's just dim it down a bit so you can read it. And then we'll key the radio. Not the easiest to see, but look, because of the uh, dummy load, look, nearly six watts, 1.01 SWR. That's not bad, is it? Let's try it, let's go back. That was on two meters. Let's try 70 centimeters. Four, three, three. Zero, zero, zero. All right, let's try that. Four, three, three, zero, zero, zero. Five watts. There you go. And it's just on a dummy load. So I, I think these are pretty good, these. For what you pay, they look a bit like an FT3. Cord band. They do air band, marine band, VHF, UHF, dual receive. So yeah, just thought I'd have a go at that. Seven three, thanks for watching. All the best. Got my new antenna. Not really. <laughs> Surecom SWR meter.